What is up guys? It is Stubbs. And we are here playing Ark Survival Evolved again. Yeah. They finally fixed the crashing problem, so now we can go ahead and do stuff. They actually released the little patch um a little bit early. So I'm very, very happy about that. And I'm just logging in. Cause yesterday I did do some playing. But it was mostly just some boring taming stuff. So I really didn't want to record all of the boring tames that I did. But I did take Rexanne out a little bit. Leveled her up a little bit. Took Snack back out. Leveled her up a little bit. And the babies here are adolescent and almost fully grown. And I cannot hand feed this Giganto Packy Kibble because I do not have any. Anyway, I will show you guys what I teamed up yesterday. <coughs> Excuse me. And we have been getting some eggs in this lovely dino storage area here that we have. And of course, there's not going to be any as we come in. But I did tame up a couple parasaurs here. Why are you, like, all inside the wall, buddy? It shouldn't be like that. So, you got a couple parasaurs. And got a turtle, which has a level, and we will just make him, <clears throat> excuse me, we will make him just a straight up tank. Um, we have not had any raptor eggs yet. We did have a couple scorpion eggs, and we did have a pteranodon egg that fell through the ceiling, which is not a problem, because as I'm checking the raptors over there, I was able to see it on the floor. So, that's not an egg, that's poop. Yep, that's poop. Okay. So, that's not all that I tamed. Let's go ahead and close that up. And we'll run right up here. So, I do have a plan on what we are going to try to do today. So, I have corn up here on neutral. Because since I did the Dino Wipe, we have been having quite a bit of problems in here. We had a couple raptors spawn in over there. Where Jane and Tarzan usually gather all of their fiber needs. But luckily they were able to take the raptors out. So I have Corrin up here since he is my strongest dino that could really fit up here. And he has 1,476 melee damage. 9,500 health. So he's doing alright. And yes, I do have the Parasaur Saddles on him. Because I took him out while I went to go tame. So I ran to the other base as well and grabbed the other Listro that we had. So now we have a male and a female within distance. So maybe they'll lay some Listro eggs. But I also tamed another Argentivis right here. Uh, she was level 90. So she tamed out at, um, I want to say like 130 something. I think she only got a couple levels on her. But Bloodwing is our carry bird, of course. And Lustrous is going to be our attack bird. And then this little guy right here. Found him over by the dino storage pen. He was caught in between the wall and the in one of the big behemoth gates. So I just went ahead and knocked him out and tamed him right up. Which, luckily, I had a couple pieces of prime on me from going out with Snack Pack. It was recently after. And he only took like three, three prime, three, three to four prime to actually do something. Um, but today, we will be going to the snow biome area. And no, I didn't want to do that, no. I wanted to move them up here. No. Can, can you cooperate here? Please? Thank you. Alright. Made a couple darts in advance, but we will we will be going to the snow biome. And possibly getting ourselves like a dire wolf, or a megaloceros, or Something along those lines. Actually, before we go, 
I should probably go ahead and repair this guy. If we have enough materials to, yes we do. Alright, so now that guy's repaired. All the other weapons are pretty pretty well done. So let's go ahead and just check ourselves out in this armor. This is actually the first time I've ever had to wear the fur armor. So I've never really taken a good look at it. But we may go ahead and dye this. I'm not too sure yet. But we'll see in the future. It depends on how often we use it really. But anyway, we're going to take Lustrous out. We will be heading to the north area over there. And I will bring you guys back once we get over there. Alright guys, we are now right by the snow biome here. And... <clears throat> excuse me. There is a Rex right there. Let's see what level it is. It is a level 55. We will go ahead and see what kind of damage Lustrous can do. Let's see. The Rex really isn't attacking us, so that's not an issue of us dying. It is too busy on the ankle. Oh, could I speak too soon? Alright, definitely damage can be boosted up a little bit more. Come on. Those meat boosted ankles too. Aw, oh, we didn't get credit for killing it, no. But we can take all of the raw prime and stuff off of it and then fly away because I am not messing with those anklos. Alright, so I'm hopefully looking for like a dire wolf out here. I would love to get a mammoth, but right now we have no way in really transporting it back home other than walking it through the swamp. I mean, I could build a raft but, actually, what would I need for a raft? Because if it's something rather quick, I know it's a lot of wood. I know that much. Wood, fiber, and hide. That's actually not too bad. We may be able to go ahead and do that. I think we have... We can get hide rather, rather quickly. <clears throat> the problem is, I don't... There's not many berries around here for me to gather. And that's what mammoths eat. Huh. Okay, so there are little bushes down here that I can gather from. Um, oh, there's another Rex right up that way. Attacking woolly rhinos. <laughs> Good luck, buddy. Good luck. Woolly rhinos are a pain to fight. What level is this guy? Level 90... I know there's another one right here. Level 55. And then there's the one more that's right there. 45, 45, 25. So far our best option would be this one right here. So let's go ahead and See if we can lure it out this way here. That's right, shoot it right in his butt. Right in the butt. Come on. Let's go. Go to sleep. I know you're, you're going to be getting tired in a few. Get out of the way, Ankylo. I don't want to shoot you. No! Fly away! Fly away! Alright, right up, right up here should be just about fine. I don't think you could really get us from here. Or I could just kind of glitch through this rock right here. That's awesome as well. Come on. <clears throat> Come on. I gotta get a little bit higher. <clears throat> oh, 
But I think right here would be a nice safe spot too. I don't see much terrible things in the area. So hopefully we're able to get this guy. Come on, just knock out. Don't don't go too far. Come on. Come on. Just knock out. Come home with me. You'll be happy. You'll be happy at the new home. Come on. Come on. And he's gonna go run away. Come on. Come on, is my... Okay. My guy was missing the reload animation. Alright. Come on! Stop running away! Stop doing this to me! There we go. There we go. There we go. Okay. So now I need to quickly find some... Some berries. Where did I see those? Little berry bushes. Oh. There's one. Doesn't matter what berries. I know it's not going to be a high level team really. But I know it will take a while. Seeing that it is a herbivore. So. I'm just going to gather up a bunch of berries here. I do have narcotics. I did come prepared. Ooh that might be a problem down there if they come up. Hopefully they don't. Oh, another bush. So basically the only thing that I really have to watch out for is some dire bears and some uh, 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 Argentavises for the most part. So as long as I don't do anything to these rhinos, they should leave me alone. We'll go ahead, drop that, 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 that. And I'll go ahead and put the narco berries on it as well. So if we get a hundred percent, it'll be plus forty-four levels, if I saw that correctly. So we're gonna go ahead and let this guy tame up. Or this girl. I forgot what it was. But we're gonna gather up some more berries here, like so. Come on, there we go. And Lustrous is right there, like a good bird. So we're just gonna keep piling berries upon berries on top of this, on top of this guy. Yeah, we were right. And I'm probably gonna go ahead and gather some, some wood and stuff and make a raft so we can get this guy back home. So. I will bring you guys back when it is almost tamed. Alright guys, we are back. And the Mammoth is almost tamed. And if you can't tell, the taming effectiveness is way, way down. It only now has plus 5 levels. Um, earlier it had plus 44 at 100%. But we had a couple hiccups along the way. As I was collecting berries, we had a couple dire wolves. <coughs> come over and start attacking him so I ended up killing one and I went on lustrous over there picked up the other and then tamed it it was a level 140 luckily I had some prime meat on lustrous from killing uh, a rex that happened to just be wandering over there I killed it just so it doesn't come over here and <clears throat> excuse me um, ended up taming it really really quickly with the prime so it came out to be 209. I believe it was 100% effectiveness or somewhere along those lines like 90 99 point like 4 or something like that. Basically 100%. But I went ahead and I was able to make up some wooden foundations and I did however make a raft which happens to be right here. Let's just get rid of some of that stuff that we don't need here. But yeah, we have the wooden raft. We have some platforms and stuff to set up on it. Oh, you got a level already, don't you? I'm going to bump health a little bit. And then work on the melee damage. But this guy is almost tamed up. If I can jump up on this rock again, that would be swell. 
Come on, can I do it? I did it perfectly so many other times. There we go. Got ourselves a mammoth. Woohoo! So I have the perfect name for this guy. This guy is a trooper. He survived two dire wolf attacks and everything. Oh, they tame up at full health. I, I was unaware of that, actually. That's pretty awesome. I did not know that. Anyway, we will go ahead and start to take, make our way down the mountain here with our new 95 Mammoth and 210 Dire Wolf. I don't think there's anything that's going to mess with us on the way down. All we have is just Mammoths and these Woolly Rhinos. We may have another Dire Wolf. Uh, can, can you not step on me, please? Trooper? Trooper? There we go. Okay. Oh. Can, can you stop stepping on me, Trooper? Um. Yeah, we may have to worry about maybe... Can you stop stepping on me? Seriously, Trooper. I know you just survived a lot, but don't have to become a big pain here. You know what? I'm going to go ahead and change that. You stop following. You can follow our dire wolf. Come on. I'm looking at you, buddy. You. Follow. There you go. Did I just hear another dire wolf? Or is that just mine? Okay, I'm guessing it's mine. Which, obviously we do not have a name for. Which for now is perfectly fine. We have a name for our mammoth. Which was what we primarily came out here for. And we are now in the swamp area. Right, come on guys, give me a hand here. There we go. I just want to get this drop real quick. That's all I want. I just want to get the drop. And it's not even worth it. Alright guys. Come on, head over this way real quick. Oh no, Titan Bower. Ooh. Titan Bowers, I do not want to mess with. Because if we end up getting knocked out, we are like royally screwed. Okay, can I not? I can't use it yet. Do I have to be like in, in the water? Do I have to be in the water? Yeah, okay. So, um, I'm going to sit here and hide the sail. Okay, there you are, trooper. Okay. I had me a little worried there for a second. So we're gonna do that. What did you get? I'm gonna keep that metal hatchet there. Oh. There we go. A little bit of melee damage. Not too much because, you know, to mammoth and all, you don't really need weight or melee damage on a mammoth. So we'll go ahead and do that. Hatch frame. I mean, and I know all of this right here is just going to be temporary anyway. <coughs> Excuse me. Um. Okay, so I definitely did not plan that properly. But let's see. Am I able to at least get these guys on the raft without having to build ramps? Let's find out since we are practically on land here. All right. Oh, that's right. I cannot ride you. I do not have... I don't have a saddle for you. Now this is going to be... This is going to be fun.
This is gonna be fun trying to get this guy back. Come on. There you go. Right there. Stop. Stop right where you are, boy. Alright. Now the dire wolf we do not need a saddle for, thankfully. Should be able to just park him. Should be able to basically just park him right up here. Alright, really? Why are you following me? I did not tell you to follow me. Okay, I might actually have to go ahead and make a ramp real quick. Um, so what do I need to make a ramp, first off? I think, what are you doing, Lustrous? What are you doing? I need wood and thatch. What are you doing? Land. Thank you. Being so darn difficult. Okay, I think I just need a little bit more thatch now. Can I get my pick? Thank you. Oh, too far. Okay. So now I should be able to make a ramp. I don't feel like searching for it right now. Okay, I need more wood. That's perfectly fine. We have plenty of wood out, out here. Okay. I might have to make a couple ceilings as well. Just to make sure that there's enough room on here for <laughs> everyone. Um... What do I need to make a wooden ceiling? A wooden ceiling. I just need wood. That should not be a problem. We will gather some real quick. And we're going to need, I think, some more thatch. We'll just go ahead and... Ooh, that was a lot of wood from that tree. Alright, so... Are those ichthys? Don't have one of those either. But anyway... Okay, I can only make one. I'm gonna go ahead and eat. What do I need? I need more wood. God, this is... This is not working out. I was expecting to be able to just put foundations on and then just be able to roll with it. But no. The mammoth has to be the size of a house. Wasn't quite expecting any of this. Anyways, can still only make one. I'm going to try to avoid that guy over there. And there's a Sarko right there as well. Gonna try to avoid that guy. Okay, so now there's that. I'm gonna take the new Dire Wolf with me. Just because there is stuff over here that can kill me very easily. Okay. Okay. I forgot it was on follow. Oh, there's a Titan Bower right there. I thought I saw a Titan Bower there. Oh boy, here comes the Sarko. No! I had to be on the tree. I had to be on the tree. Run! Alright, anyway guys. I'm going to go ahead and cut it here. I'm going to get these guys onto the... Darn raft here. Ooh, it's level 130. Oh boy. Oh boy. This is this is a bit of a tough tough one here. I think we're fighting Dimorphodons too. Oh no. No. Oh, ooh, ooh. So many Dimorphodons. Go away. I didn't want to fight you guys. Go away. And all the Meganora. No! Go away. Okay, after this huge battle, I will cut it.
Oh no, I am hurt. I am dead. Alright guys, after that death, I had to grab Bloodwing. I had to spawn at the base, and then grab Bloodwing. And then come back. So, they ate my body, of course. And, oh, you have a level. Awesome. Let's go ahead and pump melee damage on you. Got quite a few levels. Nice. Um, it seems like the uh, Morphodons de aggroed on me, or my guy killed them all. I'm not too sure. But, I did get all my stuff back. And I do need to make more, more things. So I accidentally put a piece of wood on Bloodwing there. Oh, there is an Argentavis right there that's attacking a dire wolf. Um. So yeah, we're gonna try to go collect some more wood here to make a couple more ceilings. Hopefully without dying again. Because if we die again, we're going to have to spawn at the old base, because I have not put a bed up at the new base. All I had was a sleeping bag. Stupid me, right? Here we go. Making four ceilings. Yeah. Go over there, attack that stuff over there, dire wolf. Alright, now I gotta run. I'm going to have to... Can I, like, do what I want to do here? Dang, game. Alright. All of you follow me. Come over here. Get out of my way. Now you can... Now you can all stop. Because... I'm probably going to end up having to make two more. Putting two more right up on the front here. Excuse me. And then I can only make one more for now. And I'll probably need to get a little bit more wood just so I could gather or make another ramp. And there's a Titan Bow right there. So we're going to run over this way. And we're going to get the wood over here. <laughs> the little bit of wood that we have here. Alright, come on. Come on. Come on. Just get this tree. We can go craft that up real quick. Nothing is coming after us. Good. This trip is becoming a lot more of a hassle than I thought it was going to be. Thought we were just gonna come here, tame something real quick, pop it onto the raft, and then head right home. Who told you that you can land on the raft? Nobody told you you can land on the raft. I can't even jump onto the raft. Oh, I can from that way. <laughs> Just kidding. Okay, so... Ramp. Who's in a battle with what? Oh. Okay, Titan Bow. Get him, Dire Wolf. Yeah, mess him up. Can I make another ramp? Yes. Just enough materials to make another ramp. What are you spazzing out? Oh, Meganora. Okay. So where's the dire wolf? Why is the dire wolf? Get out of the water. You're crazy. Alright, come on. Get out of the leg. See if Lustrous can help out with this problem here. Meganora are like the most annoying thing in the game, other than Dillo's when you first start off. Okay. So. As stupid as this. Words. 
as stupid as this sounds, let's check this drop here. And nothing. Goodbye drop. Alright. So. We're good, right? Okay, so, trooper. I just want you to follow. Come on. A little bit more. Alright. You should be perfectly fine right there. Right, you. You can just sit your butt right there. If anything, I can just have these guys just fly behind us and follow. What are you doing, Bloodwing? Okay, okay, nice. Okay, didn't even have to force you to do that. Okay, so, as much as I cannot see, <laughs> I will bring you guys back once we get back to base. Alright guys, we are back at base, and Trooper definitely is a big trooper, because on our way back, we hit some land, and then we hit a pack of sabers. And as you can see, his health is really low. So he almost died again. But luckily, we have him back at home. And this packy here is stomping pretty darn loud. Do you mind here? I'm trying to record a video, Mr. Packy. And where's the other one? Is this one a female? Or are they both male? They're both male. Okay. But let's go ahead and actually bring our direwolf in here. He can hang out with Corin somewhere in here. I'll probably just park him right here for now. He also got a level. Give him a little bit more health. But we will go ahead and learn the mammoth saddle since I don't think that we haven't learned quite yet. Mammoth. We do not, and we have to make it at the smithy, which is right here. Saddles. Where is Mammoth? Right there. Look at that. With plenty of materials to go ahead and make him a saddle. So we will go ahead and do so. We will grab it once it is done, place it on Trooper, and then we will go put him in his home. Ooh, an Ankylo egg! Very nice, very nice. Do we have a Listro egg? No. Unfortunately, we do not. How many levels did you gain here, buddy? Only one? Ah, uh, you can do better than that. Anyway, we're gonna run back over here. We'll put the birds back later. I'm more concerned about Trooper right now. Seeing as he's almost dead. And I am dehydrated. Look at that. Ooh, this is much better. Having a saddle on him and everything. Whew. Go ahead and clear some of this area out here. Like so? Yeah. And now you got some food on you, buddy. Ooh, snack pack. What are you doing? Do you not like our new guest? It's rude. Alright, let's check out these guys' levels real quick. No level. Kinda of no level. Well, our beaver is done. Very nicely done. Um, I'll set you to neutral and then passive. Because we do not need a non-attack beaver attacking right now. This is not food! This beaver here is not food for you guys. Don't look at me like that. No. No. It's not food. See the ways they were looking at it? Can't believe them. Anyway, let's go check to see if we have any eggs real quick. And then we'll go ahead and put the birds away. Are these the same two? 130 and 60? Yep. Okay. So let's check for eggs real quick. No scorpions, no ankylos, no parasaurs, and still no raptor eggs. 
Um, I do need to get myself an over raptor at some point as well. I'm surprised I don't have more pteranodon eggs since I do have all five, one male and four females. Um, I'm probably gonna have to breed some raptors again and breed some ankylos as well. I'll probably do a parasaur as well since we do have a male and a female of those. Um, I'm gonna go check up on Jane and Tarzan, make sure that they're okay. See if they got into any trouble while we were away. Um, nope, health is fine. It appears that she did everything that she had to do. I do need to repair her helmet. I'm just gonna keep pumping some health on her. Oops, gotta give her her berries back. And I'm not sure if I showed you guys this, but with that alpha that we killed an episode or two ago, we got another Rexbone helmet skin. So I went ahead and threw that on Tarzan. So now Jane and Tarzan match as far as helmets go. But I think Jane's has, um, is a higher. I think hers is, yeah, an apprentice that I found in a loot drop. So, that's that. The Giganto should be... Really? I figured he'd be closer to, uh... Closer to being ma fully matured. So let's go ahead and throw that in there. We're gonna go ahead and throw this... Why am I dehydrated again? I just drank! all the running around that I'm doing. We'll go ahead and eat. We'll run up here. I'm hot. I know that. We'll go ahead park Bloodwing. Which Bloodwing will be right there. Corin, you can go back to your area here. I know, the Dimorphodon's kind of taking your spot. That's uh, only temporary, buddy. Don't worry about it. Alright. And then we have Lustrous, which has my flak gear. Oh, you got some slingshot. No, no. No, no, no. No, no. Alright, we're just going to go ahead and drop a bunch of this stuff here since we don't need it. And we do not need that either. But. Ah, uh, much better. But we will, however, throw our fur armor back on Lustrous. Since she is our attack bird, if we end up going back over there, we will be bringing her just, just so we have some defense. And go ahead, park her right to here. Can I get out now? Let me get out, thank you. I'm gonna pet you, pet you. Run to the refrigerator. All right, put the Anklo egg in there. And yeah, these are all the eggs that happen to have been at the old base, except for the two scorpion and the pteranodon, and of course the spino egg. But I haven't made any sort of kibble yet, which will be happening within a couple episodes here. I'll probably make some dodo kibble and tame something with that. We'll have to, we'll just have to wait and see. But, as always guys, if you liked the video, hit that like button for me. Oh, no. Hit that like button for me. If you're new, hit that subscribe button as well, that little red box down there, right by my name, underneath the video, hit that to subscribe for more videos. And as always guys, I'll see you in the next one.